welcome this is the energy vibration reading for all sun moon and rising tauruses i want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back it has been a wonderful wonderful experience a wonderful journey it is a wonderful time in our lives and this is the time of you guys zodiac energy vibration for the year 2017 so this is a wonderful time I want to say thank you to each and every person that has left messages behind on my channel thank you and I want to ask you to leave more messages more good positive messages because what that is going to do is to help to rise raise the vibration of other people who read these messages so you know thank you for the messages for all the types of messages that I've received but just keep on doing it I'm still I'm, I'm reading them I listen to you and uh, this is wonderful I'm sorry for the noises the last time but I'm hoping that that will also still you know sometimes you want to do something good but yet still the energy that is there okay what I want to say to each and every person out here is that this is a wonderful time this is a blessed time this is the zodiac energy vibration of your birthday which is going to end on the 20th of May and you need to um, activate the energies that are coming in because for you guys in the month of May you the month of May energy vibration is the energy of the devil but yet still with this energy of the devil what is happening and what is uh, um, happening for all of us is that changes are coming in the energy of love is here and these wonderful vibrant in uh, energies are going to come true your focus is going to be the energy of the magician I'm loving this card I've always loved this card the energy of the magician has all the four aspects of what can help you in your life and this is going to lead you to a place of wonderful successful things happen in your life it's going to show you the door it's going to show you the way towards wonderful energy vibration that is going to happen you you begin the energy vibration of this month of May with the earth energy um, and then you're going to transform on the 20 um, first of May to the energy vibration of the hair energy so it doesn't really matter because the people who are borderline between the energy vibration of uh, um, the energy of uh, um, the Tauruses and uh, the Gemini's are going to be extremely extremely lucky I should say that you are going to end your zodiac energy vibration on the energy of uh, um, satisfaction satisfaction in the way that you are victory victoriously successful over something that has been a negative part in your life general energies for the first week it's going to be the energy of love the energy that you have is your own energy vibration yes the king of pentacles oh my gosh sorry guys have to put the glasses on the king of pentacles so you have the king of pentacles which is your own energy vibration with the energy of the lovers so for the men in this first week it's going to be an extremely powerful week and love for the men love love in business luck there's just you men are going to not only the men but you Tauruses are going to especially if you were born in the first week is from the first of May until the seventh of May is going to be exubilated it's going to be luck is so it is the wheel of fortune come without the 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 fortune come without the wheel of fortune so remember that the first week you're going to carry your own energy vibration and this is going to be an energy of love you connecting on the foresight of love you're working with the color blue and you're working with bittersweet bittersweet you're working with bittersweet and 
the energy of bittersweet is one of those energy vibration where we feel the bittersweetness of the love wow so as i've said this is going to the first week is going to connect in high energy vibration with a lot of stuff just a lot of stuff stuff that you weren't expecting the energy of the Pentacles comes up several times in your reading so be aware of this okay I'm working with a lot of energies in this week I want to see was there another message that came out the energy of love this is beautiful so the first week the energy of love is going to be extremely powerful extremely powerful love you're going to connect with people from a soul family this is the energy of the um, love of um, your your um, soulmate and twin flames the soulmate and twin flame love is coming in in this first week for you Taurus it's going to be extremely wonderful whether it's in business or in love it's going to be a bittersweet but love is going to be so fantastic and so accommodating as we move on as we move on to see what will be happening we will have the energy vibration of the general energies of strength and with strength we have the energy of the ace of sword and I want to say to each and every person out there this is the end of the zodiac energy vibration and with strength and the um, the sword energy it is saying to you whatever that has transpired that you had to go within to find the inner strength you are going to be victorious over this situation so whatever it was that you had suffered and gone through you're going to be extremely triumphant over this situation so you have the ace of sword um, coming in and letting you see how brilliantly wonderful it's going to be in the second week the energy that comes up and the color it's going to be orange and it's going to be the feeling of guilt and we should never feel guilty about anything in our lives there's certain aspects and certain things that we can never change for whatever reason it is so in the second week don't be um, guilty of uh, you know exaggerating and letting you show that you have win whatever and overcome whatever that was your obstacle it is good and celebrate this call upon Archangel Metatron in this week for stand and support you in wonderful new energies and new situation coming in your life in wonderful ways be aware of this sort of a situation because what is happening with the energy of guilt um, you will feel um, as if you didn't have to use that sort of energy but sometimes you need to stand up for your own and this is what this energy is saying stand up for your own in the second week as we move forward there is good messages coming in the second week to a lot of you um, it is the ending of your zodiac birthday and there is a lot of good messages coming in be aware and know that this sort of a situation is going to be good it's going to be excellent it's going to be the time when these wonderful sort of a situation good news is on its way because feeling guilty about something that you can't change is not going to help a situation as we move on and we look at the third week the third week we have the energy vibration of the Empress and the ace of Pentacles this means money 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 how is funny 
in a different world the universal angels is going to bring a lot of you people money in the third week it's going to be a lot of money because when the Empress is here with the ace of Pentacles this has to do with your health but also that it has to do with your monetary financial support supplies will be coming in your life and this will be vibrating at a higher energy vibration so money is going to be the focus of the third week and it will be coming in so maybe the week before that was the good news that you had received because the energy of money is here you have the Empress and the ace of Pentacles which is just um, fantastic news coming in as we move on and we look at the facet of what is happening with the chakras in the third week what chakras needs to be ill in the third week we have you know victim victim so the energy of victim seems to come in seems coming that it has been coming up for a lot of people a lot of sign so you have the energy of victim so what is happening is that you don't want to be the person who's going to be victimized over certain aspects as if you know you've been the lottery and you are a victim of your own um you know happiness your own luck your own the money that is coming in you become a victim of that whole aspect of it do not let anyone put you in that energy vibration because you know it's not the one of the most beautiful thing because the universe is going to bless you with something which was unexpected so wherever is happening it's going to be a beautiful month for you guys okay an extremely beautiful month as we move forward and we are elevating on the fourth week be aware um, um, for the people who are working that your boss is going to try and cheat on you or look at something that you weren't aware or people are going to try to connect with you but yet still try to manipulate certain sort of a situation and be aware because these people are not vibrating on the high energy vibration okay it's a seven of seven of uh, our starver the seven of starver is that you're protecting yourself in the fourth week so this is extremely good because whenever we come to the aspect that we start to protect ourselves it's going to be a wonderful time wow wisdom i had wisdom a wonderful time so you know what we're going to have is this pornancy which is the color of purple this poor Nancy the color of purple so as we move on and we look along and we're trying to understand what the aspect of certain things that are happening in our life is so wisdom also comes up with uh, wisdom is the partition of certain aspect uh, and inner wisdom is one of the most beautiful beautiful energies you can look for as we move on to the fourth week as I've said this pregnancy but yet still what are the Taurus is going to find in the fourth week to deal with what are the Taurus is going to find in the fourth week to deal with what have Taurus is going to find in the fourth week to deal with the end of people stealing from you the end of people stealing for you okay it's the end the end and <laughs> they are stealing money from you okay we're stealing money from you so whatever who was stealing it is an end it is really an end it has come to an end it has come to an end 
So, what we need to understand is that our lives have many parts and many journeys to take. We need to understand the aspect of where we are and where we are going. The magician bring us all the elements, all the stuff that we need. And as you look at this week, this month, I'm constantly saying month, a week. As we look at this month, and we're going to examine it. This month has to do with relationship and partnership, a love relationship and business relationship. And what is happening is that there is a lesson to the love relationship. Good news is on its way. New love is coming in your life. A passionate message is coming to you. Okay? And it's going to be a good message that is coming in. And, you know, an invitation. You're going to receive an invitation. Happy news is on its way to you. Okay? And this is extremely good for, I think that, you know, this is extremely good because um, this is a time when we're going to connect in certain ways, which is going to help us to move the awareness of our consciousness further uh, and to understand where we are on our journey. So happiness is short and anticipated happiness is short and anticipated but it doesn't really matter because you have the king of pentacles and this is so wonderful um, with your reading king of pentacles um, the ace of pentacles and the um, the the, um, the ace of of pentacles so you know looking at this aspect of your um, month is going to be the first week is the king of pentacles your own energy vibration the second week you have the sword the uh, ace of sword and the third week you have the ace of pentacles and yet you have in the second week you're protecting yourself as we uh, focus on all of these energies you're going to realize that money is not going to be any problem money success being victorious and having money and being victorious is going to have a wonderful extremely wonderful wonderful energies that is going to help you to formalize a sense and what I so love about your reading is that the masculine aspect of these reading are coming out in full full ways and uh, you have uh, the energy of uh, uh, working with Archangel Michael in the first week the blue ray in the second week you have the orange ray in the third week you have the green ray which is healing your art chakra then in the fourth week you have the purple ray which you know most people in this reading is showing you and highlighting certain aspect of uh, um, your life in a wonderful new way so we need to understand this this the, the, the situation and the part the journey we are on to be aware of certain aspect and being aware of these aspects and understanding how far and what we need to accomplish on our journeys you're going to be seen and radiating with wonderful new energy vibrations so you know it's sometimes we need to understand how very important it is to capture the best moment that life has to offer and when we understand how and how we can um, capture these things we understand how powerful we are and how we ourselves can um, change the energy of certain aspect around us life is about to change for you Tauruses the energy of the magician being between the energy of the magician you have the power to manifest success and victory but yet still full mark of abundancy full mark of abundancy is coming in so 
whatever you may think and say in this week in this month I'm sorry it's going to vibrate and take you to an higher energy vibration where it's going to fill you with powerful energies of light and I want to say to each and every person out there namaste until next week